Well, uh, Councillor Dortmund, thanks for reaching out and having a valiant attempt. I tried to write a comment, uh, but uh, it won't accept a written comment, uh, but a video. So uh, I'm not, I wasn't ready to write uh, to speak, but uh, I will try my best. Uh, I think some of the things that you're trying to do are be beyond your pay grade. Uh, the Western society has created the country concept, uh, but you folks are constantly ignoring it, uh, ignoring the rule of law by using drones to kill innocent people. Uh, I say innocent because they uh, should be tried in a court of law if uh, uh, they are involved in any uh, anti-people activities, whether it's killing our people or your people. Uh, your involvement in politics in other countries uh, is a disgrace and creates the enemies uh, that uh, we have. Uh, uh, how dare you impose an NRO uh, ordinance on our people? Uh, letting the politicians getting away with the crooked uh, gains that they have made at our expense. Uh, uh, there's a difference between the American people and the, um, and the American government. I live amongst uh, your people here in the Los Angeles area and the uh, average American is a wonderful person just like you seem to be, uh, but the government's actions uh, have a lot to be desired. Instead of supporting the good guys and a good cause and a good open society. Uh, it seems like uh, uh, you folks end up supporting uh, the lesser of the two evils. Uh, when I was in Karachi University, uh, we had a big conflict with the Chinese and the Russians uh, and you folks and uh, all three uh, had gangs and goons that they employed. The only difference was that you freely gave a lot of money to the people that supported your cause versus the Chinese uh, communists at that time uh, who had uh, people who were just motivated uh, by their cause and did not need money uh, as well as the Russians, uh, Soviet, uh, who also maybe were happy to just get their expenses paid. Uh, all these people were uh, not the people that I call friends because uh, they were uh, basically thugs and uh, this has been going on for a long time I don't know if it will ever st ever ever stop what we really should be fighting like I said as an old-time debater and we all did is uh, uh, the common enemies of uh, uh, lack of three meals a day f for the typical American uh, Pakistani uh, lack of clean water lack of education uh, misuse of our national resources for fighting a proxy war with in, with India or Afghanistan uh, and not having uh, a society where uh, instead of making weapons of war uh, for the Pakistan army we made uh, thumb drives and we made DVD drives and TVs so that uh, our people were gainfully employed. In fact uh, we are worse off than when I was there with the constant load shedding. I mean, uh, power is one of the most uh, basic uh, needs uh, has been uh, for civilized society and to uh, not have uh, power, which is basically uh, because of corruption and misuse of resources uh, that uh, uh, we are going backwards. Uh, I hope uh, you will use your influence with the American government to uh, do some of the things that you seem to want to do and reach out to just some of the average uh, Pakistanis that may not even speak English and require an interpreter to find out uh, what is really happening rather than just mingling with the elite which happens all the time which probably happened when you invited some people to your uh, wonderful home in Karachi uh, because uh, just to uh, get a visa or to or try to uh, uh, make any contact with, an, with an, any American in Pakistan in the embassy uh, is just a lost cause for the average Pakistani. Uh, good luck, have a great day. God bless Pakistan and God bless United States.